I just wanted to respond to Sam's latest video, uh, which just happened all of five minutes ago, but I was rummaging through online and I thought I'd uh, respond because I think this is exactly what Hidden Rainbow, um, I'm going to put all the stuff up here in a minute, don't worry, what Hidden Rainbow is um, all about. Um, I, I didn't have a chance to go into the, the video response that Sam's video was based on, but I think that are we a gay community and do we abolish the term gay community? I don't think we should. I hear what you're saying and I understand and I agree in the most part. But I also think that back when it was that term was coined, surely sometime in the during the the civil rights movement when when gays were 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 trying to um, obtain their rights, that term was very important. Nowadays, I don't think that we are a community. I think that this idea of segregation within the gay community is very prevalent. Everybody has a label. Everybody needs to be labeled. Their sexual preferences are labeled because that way we can categorize each other. I don't understand why this group of individuals who, who says they're gay feels the need to do that because I think it hurts us in the, in the long run, and I agree with that. But I think... I don't think that it um, hurts the straight community. I think it gives them a frame of reference. Because at the end of the day, the community as a whole is never going to see us as equal. They're always going to label us as something, so we may as well give them something to label us as. It's better than fucking faggot. It's better than dyke. It's better than rug muncher. All It's better than all the derogatory terms. Gay community is pretty safe. So... In that sense, I think it will stay only because it's a frame of reference for everybody else. In terms of the way I feel about it within the gay community, I don't think it's right. I think that we as a gay community have to stop hurting each other. We need to stop labeling one another. We need to stop giving each other terms like twink, tranny, queer. Well, queer is not so bad. But, you know, I can't think of any right now. But... Um, I think the problem, a lot of it stems from the gay community, um, in, and then that, that filters out, that filters down. You see a lot of it on the websites, you see a lot of it on TV, certain stereotypes are fed back to us, we've talked about all this before, but I think gay community, um, on the whole is okay. I th again, I think it's better than a lot of the other stuff we've been called. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to throw my two cents in there. And I think this is very prevalent to what Hidden Rainbow talks about. I wanted to know what you guys thought about uh, Hidden Rainbow and the idea of being somebody that's doubly different, so disabled and gay, a uh, ethnic and gay. I'm, I'm just throwing out the, my original question to everybody just to get a feel for it, because is there a community within the gay community of people that are, that feel this way, or that are considered different, that have been ostracized because of it? Just a, just a, a, a question. So, great video, Sam, and, and um, I hope to hear back from you guys in one form or another. Okay, bye. I'll put my email stuff uh, up here in a second. Okay, bye.